Well, Santa Fe is the latest city in the state to create a new way to respond to mental health calls instead of police. Santa Fe Mayor Ellen Weber announced that program today called the Alternative Response Unit. News 13's Annalisa Pardo is live from her home this evening with exactly how this will work. Annalisa. Dean, last June, Albuquerque announced it was creating a community safety department to address calls of mental, behavioral health, and addiction. Now, while this is sim while this has a similar goal, rather, Santa Fe's new unit will work differently. Coming soon to Santa Fe, the Alternative Response Unit. The idea of the Alternative Response Unit is to provide services to people who have behavioral health or mental health needs who really require a different kind of service than what we give when we send a police officer out all by themselves. The new unit will start as one team made up of a paramedic, police officer, and social worker who are all trained in crisis intervention. When responding to a call, the police officer will be the only one armed, and they'll make sure the scene is safe. The paramedic will make sure the individual needing services is okay, and the caseworker will connect the individual to needed resources. While more cities are starting response units like this, Mayor Weber says this one is catered to Santa Fe. The effort with this project is to respect that family engagement with people who need this kind of help. We want families to be confident that if they have a family member who needs help and they call for help, they will get this unit coming to serve them and it will be sensitive and it'll be compassionate. A representative from the National Alliance on Mental Illness of Santa Fe calls this change in services essential. Families struggling with an individual with a mental illness diagnosis, a substance use problem, are always hesitant to call 911 for help because they're afraid it won't come out well. Mayor Weber says the unit will also help ease the amount of calls police and firefighters are responding to. He says the new unit will help make mental health a priority coming out of COVID. I think it's really critically important that the next pandemic not be a mental health pandemic. Now the city says it will track the success of this new unit by following up and seeing if people are still connected to those needed resources and by seeing if the new unit actually helps reduce the amount of calls for service for police. Back to you. All right, Annalisa, thank you. The first alternative response team will hit the streets May 4th. If approved by city council, there's about $475,000 in the city's budget to add a second team this summer.